Taking a hot shower or pouring hot tap water for a cup of coffee, those are simple things we probably take for granted. In this 8 Goes Green report, KOMU 8's Kimberly St. Ann shows us how a Centralia resident is using the sun to help heat up his cup of joe. This house is white on the outside, but inside it's green. Steve Shifley installed a solar water heater in July. We were looking to go more solar, go more green with our house. He paid about $500 per year to run his propane water heater before the solar unit. But come next year, Steve will spend only $50 per year for propane on the cloudy days. It's fantastic. There is a, a shortage of conventional fossil fuels. Um, we know that eventually um, conventional fossil fuels are going to run out. Owen's organization travels the U.S. The sun shines here just like everywhere else. Giving tours of solar-powered homes. Owen says solar-powered water heaters are easy. Once the solar panels capture the energy from the sun, it sends it to this solar storage tank, which can heat up to 150 degrees. Solar water heating systems cost seven to $10,000. The average customer gets $400 in annual savings, so the units take as long as 12 years to pay off. But there are other incentives for putting in a solar water heater. The state of Missouri gives you back another $500. Using a solar water heater also qualifies for a 30% federal tax credit. You, can, you sure feel good when you're taking that shower for as long as you want, and you know it's not costing you any money at all to do it. Leaving you with more green in your pocket and less cash in the tank. Kimberly St. Ange, KOMU 8 News, Centralia. And they say the solar water heaters require little maintenance and are designed to last for at least 30 years.